I'm Tierney Allen, and I portray Lady Gaga in Legends of Concert. I am, first and foremost, a mom, a wife, and an entertainer. I have been portraying Lady Gaga for the past 13 years, and that's also taken over a humongous part of my life. Well, the longest running show in Vegas is getting some new additions to the cast. Lady Gaga is joining Legends in Concert, and it turns out her road to becoming Gaga is thanks to an, another celebrity. How I got started as Lady Gaga is I was working at Fred Siegel in Santa Monica, and I was selling sunglasses to all the celebrity clients. Well, one day, Kate Beckinsale was buying sunglasses from me, and I was ringing her up. She said, you know, you look like that Lady Gaga. And I didn't know who Lady Gaga was. I'm like, okay. She's all, no, really, you can make a job doing that, looking like her. And I didn't understand, make a job out of looking like somebody. And she's like, you really need to look it up. Fast forward, how many years later, I'm working as a Lady Gaga tribute artist in Las Vegas. I'm sharing my story on the local news. And somehow, this story of how I met Kate Beckinsale got to her. The next day, Kate Beckinsale tweeted to her millions of followers that, oh my gosh, some throwaway comment I made years ago changed somebody's life. And I'm so happy for you, Tierney. It was the most full circle moment you could ever have in your life. The person, the reason why you changed your entire life to become this new career, she's validated it. And I'll never forget that. Part of this job on a day-to-day -day basis is also staying on top of her looks. What does her hair look like now? What kind of makeup styles is she doing? And I use that for what I'm gonna do in my show. If she's wearing a glitter eye, I'm going to recreate that, put that out there on social media. And because for me, my brand is how similar we look. I get him high, show him what I got. On stage, when I am trying to portray Lady Gaga, I have a couple things that I, I must do. One of the things is I have to yell at the audience. Come on, sing it! I'm conducting the audience, that's what she does. She yells, get your hands up, put your paws up, get up and dance. Like she is very commanding of an audience. So I like to incorporate that. I also have to incorporate a message of kindness. That is a huge part of her brand, is perpetuating kindness and equality. So when I sit down at the piano, I always like to include that. I try to make the world seem better. Oh, show me the way to cut through all this more now. I think the last thing I like to include in my performance is the overall appearance of my costumes. I've created 98% of my costumes and wigs and makeup, knowing that I made what's being worn on stage is is really important to me because I can get every single detail right. If you wanna make it country, baby, it's okay. Cause I was born, I was born, born this way. I feel like Lady Gaga and I have a similar vocal range, whether where it is in soprano range, but it does take a lot of strength to sing like her. And I don't think, I, it's a project that's never completed. I am always trying to get closer and closer. I take vocal lessons regularly. I warm up every single day. I listen to her. I try to form my words closer and closer. And you know, however I sounded last night, tonight's show, I wanna sound even more like her. Part of my makeup routine that has been such a game changer has been using the face tapes. And I learned that from Lady Gaga's makeup artist, her former makeup artist. She's been posting about it, we've been messaging, and that was a big change for my look. Before, and this is after. And another part, little tiny things, like how her lips are drawn on, or a little, a little mole that she has here. If I don't do it, then I feel like I'm not, it's not her. Well, Lady Gaga's new store, House of Gaga, is open at Park MGM, and many who were inside the hotel <laughs> casino yesterday thought they ran into Lady Gaga. Take a look. Legends in Concert shared this video with us, showing fans posing for pictures with who they thought was Lady Gaga. Turned out to be a Gaga tribute artist from the show. <laughs> she must have had a really good poker face. She played it cool. I feel so lucky 
to get to portray Lady Gaga of all the possible pop stars that I could possibly look like. I never looked like any celebrity until Lady Gaga came around. I couldn't make it in LA as a pop star, but in this life, I can be this famous pop star on stage, but still go home to my quiet family life. And I really think it's the best of both worlds. I was born this way, hey, I was born this way, hey, I'm on the right track, baby.